hi everyone this uh, video is about uh, how to perform calculations in report so usually we uh, have to create a report first and after that we need to produce and we sorry we need to perform calculation in that report so let us have all the cars i'm just going to produce a report for these cars so we'll select all the data then next and next and uh, ascending order of uh, id descending order of uh, color next landscape next and uh, finish so this is how our report will look like first you need to um, arrange it by just clicking here and typing here uh, all cars in stock then after we need to fix the uh, data and the labels so that all the data is completely visible in the final report view so we just need to fix it yeah yes arrange like that yes after arrangement you just need to use the design view to perform the calculation it is very important for you to arrange the fields in your report so your data and report is in the report is clearly seen here yeah, like here one of the field is here just yeah like that so this all the data we have here now what i'm going to do is i'm just going to perform some calculation for example i have here sales price and average price uh, sales price and their purchase price we need to get the average of sales then purchase price so what i'm going to do is right click and then just click on design view and uh, as you increase the report footer the calculation is always done in report footer then get a text box from here get a text box and just after that you just type is equal to for example sum then a round bracket will start then a square bracket will start and the name of the field for example sale underscore price then square bracket close and round bracket close when you just click on save and view and we'll go to the end you will get the sum of that field so then you go to design view and you just type here that you calculated the sum sum of sale price like that then you just need to arrange this one and if you want to have this one in format of currency just select currency and then number of decimal places two and then when you just uh, uh, preview it you will find that the it is uh, calculated in the currency now in the same way if you need to get the average also you can do it by just getting here the text box and we'll type here is equal to avg average and bracket start and square bracket start and this type i'm going to type purchase underscore price square bracket close round bracket close and the expression contains something wrong okay yes because this bracket now it is okay save and run you will get the average at the end and this average if you want to have this average in the format of currency in two decimal places you can do that in the same way we can use the function max 
and min to get maximum and minimum value so i can write is equal to max then bracket start square bracket start and then sale underscore price square bracket close round bracket close in the same way you can calculate the minimum value is equal to min small capital doesn't matter then you can write here sale underscore price that's it and one more thing which is the last thing in calculation it is just called um, <clears throat> to count the record is equal to count then you just start this bracket and then I'm going to write for example model and we'll just place this into the accurate position so that is uh, you can say total record total records and then this one is for example uh, average average of purchase price yes you can just expand this one towards your left and then like this and here you can say here maximum maximum sale price then you can say here just to move this one towards your left so that data is not disturbed and then you just write here that minimum of sale price minimum of sale price when you click on view you will get at the end the minimum maximum and total number of records so this is how we perform calculations in report hope you have learned how to perform calculation thanks for watching subscribe the channel for more updated videos